I believe some more recordings for Overworld are in order. Let's try and find some items. And for that, let's try taking up the Barbarian. And this time, we're going to go in on Elite. Let's wait, a le wait around a little bit to see his idle animation, I guess. He says working out, I guess. From the Fridge of Waste. Do wield, frenzy, berserk, hardy eater, and weak magic. Alright, so, the whole idea for us, like, you know, probably to try and find some new items, such as, like, that new battle axe, or the other weapons, or some new items. Well, that's scary to see right there. Alright, so I'm going to basically go to sleep, I'm going to put my coat over. My cloak over, I guess. Neat. All right, there's a club. Now, I said this to the developer before, but it would be cool to actually start with a club or a second weapon with the Barbarian. Just so you can actually show off, like, you know, dueling them a little bit easier. Tax time. Take this abacus, talk to free shopkeepers, then return. I was gonna pick those up, but I guess not. Now, aren't you supposed to go slower on a steed like this? Like uh, on a tortoise? If I recall correctly, when I basically walk running around in like the desert, I should be getting two like, you know, heat pips here, so that might be a mistake. Like yeah, yeah, right there you saw the bat basically double move because um basically I'm slow, so The pay for the mayor's lawn, you say? Unbelievable. Um, I think that was being my, my uh, second attack there, by the way, where, like, you know, we do wield, or frenzy. And you can see, like, you know, right there, like, you know, we're getting, like, these extra attacks here because, um, both I got the frenzy going on, I got, like, the dirt going on, and, of course, we're slow, so, I talked to the old lady here, for example. We'll talk to that cat. You know, I'm almost tempted to basically grab that dagger. I just have two two daggers basically wheel here. And I saw there was someone just got multiple hits there because I'm slow. Let's get that guy. And him. I knew voting for the mayor was a bad idea. I'm broke. Democracy doesn't pay.
Did that poison my tortoise? You stole a coin, you bastard. Here's something extra to make sure the mayor gets it. You hear the mayor calling? Yoo hoo! Your steed eats food on the ground. There's a ball again. Stun your enemies, play games with friends. I've yet to get the win for um, the gold medal basically for his ball, right? So. What? This place of the rose pruning, with 12 coins, I can sell shrubbery. You hear the sound of pickaxes inside? I berserked the squid there. The good thing is that the ball floats, so I can actually leave it right there, but whatever. Find the gems inside the cave, take one item to help. Unlike the dwarf, I am susceptible to cave in, so I'm gonna watch out for that. Um, magic's not very good for his character, so. Let's leave the stuff there for now. Alright, um, my attack isn't armor piercing, by the way. Well, I got rid of that guy and uh, bumped to this guy. Now, the whole purpose of pushing this stuff here, by the way, so I can do this. Knock this guy back into the webs. Damn raccoon. Well, that killed me. There was a spider around somewhere, I guess. Now, I did find a ball there, by the way, so maybe I'll get the metal for it, the bronze one. Yep, there we go. Bronze, bronze ball. So, it's a little achievement I got metal out of that. Now, I have to wonder, like, you know, how high tier of these weapons and stuff and items I'm basically finding here. Are they very high tier and the cars like, you know, need to play high, he's like, you know, high like uh, wrist levels to basically get the stuff? Die. Yay, I got a fan! Take that. Fan lets me do that, for example. And this. A little bit of extra health. You took care of all the pests. I didn't find any chests in here, but oh well. Now, no problem taking the fan over to the net there for a simple reason that this has cooling on it. And of course, cooling lets me walk in deserts. I seek the temple. Find it for me. Explore. I keep finding turtles, and why is it so fast? Keep searching.
I don't think we have any more help for eating this, but... Oh, we do! Look at that! An extra heart. Very nice. Uh... Well, easy come, easy go. Wasn't sold a relic in deep, deep cave. Let's go find it. Just an instant bystander. Well, I got poison and you know who's in right there. Not great. There's the temple. Uh, that might be bad. I can't leave. I have to take the, you know, healing, so... There we go. It sucks to be our person, but I mean... At least I survived. Get rid of him. Get that guy. Get rid of you. This might be useful in here in case they see something I don't want, so... Uh, that's scary. We'll do that. Well, I guess that's better than, like, you know, just not having a dagger. You know, here's a problem to note about the crossbow array. Because this is a slow strike weapon, it means I'll take, like, two turns to attack stuff. It might be nice if, like, you know, you can actually choose not to, like, use your double strike, perhaps. With the barbarian to be able to carry around two weapons. Kind of like the assassin. There's a spike club. Yeah, I want the club over the um, crossbow, I think. A porcupine. Heavy spikes mean death. It shoots two. So, porcupine. Heavy spikes mean death. It shoots two. This guy's got one damage and one pierce. He's got spiky range and climber. So, the beast is able to climb up mountains. They may climb fast or slow, but you can, can't hide from them on the high ground. Run away before they catch you. Are you slow? It doesn't say you're slow. That is range by way so to avoid this like, you know, spiky ability there, so hooray. Is that a salamander? The poleaxe! Cool, we got a poleaxe. Alright, well, you know it's a weapon, and we know it's a poleaxe, so. We'll take the poleaxe. Oh, by the way, we got wands now, by the way, you can see the graphic there, thanks to the Justice hat. All the sleeping stands of the, you know, guys here, of course. Oh, look at that, I traded gem for gem.
Let's go up the other way. The anger guy is waking up. I haven't found the gatekeeper yet, so we'll have to find him. That was quick. Apparently the prayer doesn't burn anything by the way. That's cool. Just so they can. I'm tempted to buy stuff in here for the sake of buying it and like, you know, Hopefully for like a, an I'm the pop. Uh, unfortunately nothing popped. Oh well. You barely notice the gatekeeper as you pass by. Alright, so technically that's my high score for elites. There's our encounter with the porcupine. And we got gold porcupine, kill one and win the game. So, there's a medal there, right there, too. I have 100,000, or 126,250 points of experience. Alright, well, there's a win of the bar barbarian right there. If I go to my high scores, you can see that, you know, now my reverence space is like, you know, in fourth place there. Both for Iron Man and, you know, regular. And yeah, there's still that issue of like, you know, all the easy people like to gain are like, you know, um, times first. I think the developer has said that if like, you know, um, all those basically like the cleared up is like enough like you know higher score winners, but it has to been like more than ten people more than ten, ten, ten uh, blah. Has there been more than ten people playing the game? Cause it's kind of annoying basically seeing all those people play like right here. There's least moves by the way. So I had 251, eight, um, 251 moves of that barbarian uh, playthrough right there. And of course, again, for easy mode to basically get through a lot faster, so they still have us and such. Alright, well, that's about where I'm to basically play there. Let's play another character. So, one character I haven't played for a while now is the Fug. Let's play with him. One Bad Mother. Go talk to my boyfriend. The scrolls optionally says. Chauvinous pig. Wow, your muscles are big. Why are you angry? Uh, I don't want to be hit by you. Take that. You lost Grand Square. Better luck next time. I almost won that time. The diamond is yours. So yes, you can actually get items from like, you know, cares of like with the dice. I know good at these games. You win, the chili's your chili's yours. Oh yeah, I forgot. I'm hated, so these guys all hate me.
I feel like I can climb out of holes easily. So that's what the fuck looks like when he's sleeping. What does idle animation look like? Villainous. That's what he looks like. Alright, we're on a horse. We got the chili. I'm taking a long time to basically play right here, but whatever. Oops, they activated Thief right there. That was not intentional, but oh well. Okay, you gotta have it. It's fine. Let's get this. I can't remember if you get slowed down on a horse with like, you know, slow gear like this. I don't think you do because the horse is carrying it, right? So... Oh, that's something to basically keep in mind. There is no like, you know, idle animations you're on a horse. Because, you know, you're on a horse. Whatever, I don't see anything in here. That's annoying. Ow. You took the mushroom, you bastard. Yeah, chasing him down is going to be pointless, so we'll avoid him. Now, I did get, like, some burn damage from, like, the desert there, so... Maybe I am, like, slow with the barrel on a horse? Not really sure. A piercing overhead cry sends you cowering. I'm taking too long. Everything wants to kill me now. What is it with all these hawks I keep running into? Of course, why not? There's a tortoise. At least I do have pierce of his weapon, so... We'll kill him off. Well, that's unfortunate. There he goes. And just to add um, insult to injury, do you like, you know, horse drop the lance? That was a mistake. Didn't kill me though. Now I'm moving very slowly now because I got the barrels on me, so that's a thing. And I know they're getting double moves on me there if, like, you know, they try to. Well, 
There's a wind gust blowing out on the mountain. Now here's a problem. Am I gonna actually like gamble this guy while I basically have a scroll? No. A letter for me? Oh Sally. Well, that's nice. Now this guy of course can easily get up to me, so. Why not? Now I got more stuff attacking me. Well, at least I can dice for a helmet. Now I can buy new shoes. Better luck next time. Lucky seven. The helmet's yours. There's a little bit of armor. Hopefully it helps me a little bit. There's the bear trap. The bear trap has been apparently updated recently, so that it's now like, you know, instant um, uh, cast, so to speak. And apparently the transfer update now to be like, you know, um, bladed and like, you know, cleave. So instead of any like pierced, they're basically like, you know, bladed. I can't remember, were they really strong last time? I can't, like, you know, not a basis like, you know, a precise like spear. With cleave. Still really powerful, of course, but you know. How powerful were they, really? Mystic. This bomb is bomb is after you. Is that a female mystic now? Well, I'm about, about to get attacked for sure. I can't escape. I'm dead. Unfortunately, I don't think we saw any items this time around. So try again. The round passes ahead is dangerous. Take a secret tunnel. Well, I got the ball at least, so there's that. That's fun. Uh, was that plenty of them? A pistol! Shoot things nearby. Doesn't work in water. So, the pistol is a weapon I actually recommend to develop to add, add to the game. It's essentially a ranged weapon that's keep dry, so it's sort of like the, the bow, but um, it's basically like, you know, one that requires you to be like out of the water. Still very powerful, of course. Right, I don't like, um, grapes. There's a way out right there, by the way. You know, that might be something to keep in mind. Um, Hardy Eater. Maybe like a nut should be considered a fruit invisible, even though it's like not a fruit invisible, but I mean, it's sort of like in that sort of like, you know, spirit like influence.
The mounts are behind you. Well done. Oh, I fought that play of him there. Maybe my friends lost the sea. So how's this work? Act fast hero, a storm's ruin. So don't let me play with him anymore. Oh well. A huge whale suddenly swallows you whole. You are inside a whale. Request is to escape. A voice cries out in the distance. There's a lance. I technically can't be a turtle, right? So... No! We lost his friend. He's dead. That would happen. More turtles. Uh, I'm gonna die from poison. Well, I did have a pistol, I guess, so it's not all like, you know, a loss there. Yeah, silver pistol, dive a pistol. There's a lot more items you find, like that battle axe, the wand, and I guess like the morning star, and. Yay, he's got flail in here! Flail. Deadly strikes in every direction. It'll be fun to find out. I have to wonder how powerful these guys are going to be. I've yet to see any of these guys just yet, but I mean, hopefully they'll pop up sooner or later. We did see the porcupine. Right there. The porcupine strikes me as being like, sort of like, you know, um, uh, what was it? The hedgehog? Except he's more powerful and, he's, and like he's got range attack, so. You know, this is an endgame piece that it says. Versus the hedgehog, which is basically, you know, more like a, a star beast. Human! You are a power bolt. We got brigands! Nice! Well, we'll have to see if we're endgame or not later on, but for now, that's it for this playthrough. Hope you guys enjoyed the little, like, you know, brief entry into the overall again. I'll do another Let's Play at some point, but for now, take care.